Hey guys, just wanted to do my reaction video to Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom, the fifth Jurassic Park entry, or second Jurassic World entry, however you want to look at it. Um, so I've been like a fan of this franchise. It means, I mean, classic. I love the idea of, you know, I've been kind of a nerd. I kind of one. The sequels were, I mean, like at least like the Lost World and Jurassic Park 3, they were okay. I wasn't like, thrilled about it but I just, like i said i just like the whole concept of the franchise and i felt like you know jurassic world i enjoyed i know it was a divisive because i feel like it borrowed too it was like the same it's like the same reason why i guess like force awakens was so divisive like i feel like it borrowed too many beats from like the original its original movie i just thought it was like a great nostalgia trip um i especially enjoy the whole like t-rex and raptors um velociraptor versus the irax and um I, I just enjoy, I mean I guess and I, and I I guess my only gripe with Jurassic World was that you know the the human characters um you know they were an acquired taste at best um and it's like and um and it's like and while like the human characters in like Jurassic Park like the other ones they were, they were much more like you know you had like Laura Dern Jeff Goldblum out uh, um Sam Neill like they had like a much more like charismatic cast i would say and i just but like i said i just you know it's the whole i still keep coming back to this franchise because i enjoy it and i feel like jurassic world was the best of the sequels i get i get the hate for it i don't need anybody to be cursing me out in the comments down below it's unnecessary like to each their own um but you know i just i guess this trailer came out yesterday either today or Either, I guess like today or yesterday, um, it was show you know it was showing up in my social media feed. So I, um, so I'm just gonna stop rambling and check it out and give you my feedback. So, uh, what are you dating like an accountant now? Or Owen. Ventriloquist. Stop it. You love a dummy. This is not why we're here. You can blame me. Try to shame me. I know why we're here. A rescue op. Save the dinosaurs from an island that's about to explode. What could go wrong? Blue is alive. You raised her. <laughs> Do these animals deserve the same protections given to other species? Or should they just be left to die? <laughs> These creatures were here before us. And if we're not careful, they're gonna be here after. You know me. Life cannot be contained. Life breaks free. Life finds a way. Oh, what? I think I got some ch got chills from like watching that. Um, I mean, I, I like how they have like a semi plausible reason, or at least they're for why they're going back, like to keep going back to this island, and and they kind of been 
running with this idea of, I guess, um, in the other in the other movie, where it's just like you know they're animals, they deserve to be protected and have some of their own sanctuary, even though all they you yeah, have like the T Rexes, like constantly just trying to T Rexes and all the other carnivores are kind of trying to eat any, anybody who's like on there. Um, and I like how I never expected Jeff they were going to bring. Um, I heard rumors, but now I, I didn't know they were like confirmed that they were going to bring back, um, like say like Jeff Goldblum for um, for this for this sequel and give it like a stronger sense of continuity with. Um, the original with the original ones i don't know if i mean i don't get the feeling he's gonna have like a major role in this i mean i just like i mean i was interested in the lines interested in the lines of they were here before us but if they're, if they're not careful they're gonna be here after us and you know and he was echo echoing um john hammond's words um life will find a way and it, it just seemed like kind of ominous and it's like i was kind of left so I'm so it kind of left me wondering like, did, is he in favor? And I guess maybe from his past experience, um, I I think I kind of get a nice sense of like, was he in favor of just like letting them die and letting that volcano just like destroy um, Isla Nublar, or was he like for just trying to find a way how the animals find sanction at least have the dinosaurs like find some level of sanctuary and at least you have. Um, at least you address like why Bryce Dallas Howard and um, Chris Pratt never became a couple, like them becoming, um, or at least like it, or at least, or at least like it didn't seem like their relationship beyond evolve um, beyond anything more than a fling or just like unresolved sexual tension. Just because it just seems like it was like that was the thing about the Jurassic World. It was like so out of the, it was kind of out of the blue, where it's just like all of a sudden, well, I guess. I don't know. I, I just didn't really... I wasn't really that invested in them. Just, it, it just seemed like you know, they were just kind of cliched and it's like hooking up just because it's like, oh, they're in danger. Not because it's just like there's any... And not because there's like any kind of real attraction. But did they get through like the whole like bickering thing where, where which is a trope where like they bicker and then they kiss and it was just like... I don't know. I feel like it's just been there and done that. But anyway, at least... So at least they realize that it's like, you know, this is purely professional. We got to go back. Um, Owen was like the velociraptor trainer when Jurassic World was running. And they were, and, um, they, you know, at least he has some kind of like emotional investment. At least trying to save that, trying to sit, help, help the dinosaurs, at least the velociraptors. And also, um, it was cool that it's like at least we're, we're going to see like other like giant like carnivore dinosaurs. They're going to they're going to still like emphasize the fact, um, you know, T Rex is still king of the dinosaurs and he's the like rain, he's the one who like reigns supreme so to speak. And I just think it's also interesting that it's like it's like it's not like um, it's like Mother Nature is why in the dinosaurs dinosaurs are in danger of going it's you know extinct again. Um, and it's like this whole and this whole thing about how they were going over the edge and, um, you know, being like, you know, knocking them over in the water and they were like just like drowning and like struggling to survive. So it's just like, are they going to move them to another island? It's like, are, you know, how many are going to survive? Or are they going to have like, I know in like promotional materials, they had like, um, pterodactyls like flying towards the mainlands like is something like that supposed to happen because i mean i mean i don't know like they have like an achillosaurus like being knocked over and it's like i don't i mean i'm pretty sure they're not they're not like i mean most of these guys most of those dinosaurs we just saw just not like they're not like amphibians they're like they could be like in danger and like and be like being drowned so at least they're going to explore like i guess like a moral, I guess, like different people's point of views, and like whether or not it's worth saving these dinosaurs or not, especially with that whole line of, um, you know, if we're not careful, we're we're gonna go like we're gonna they're gonna be here long at long after us, and life's gonna find a way. Um, and I mean, I'm sure we're gonna. I mean, I'm sure we're gonna get another um, second trailer like a few months from now clear everything up this is just clearly a teaser but 
I like what I'm seeing so far. I'm definitely checking it out. And I'm sure everyone's going to check it out. And I think it's a great first teaser, in my opinion. So how do you guys feel about it? Are you still are you looking forward to going seeing um, Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. If you like this video, like, share, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys soon. And I'll be able to... And I'm going to have my Arrow um, reaction up tonight as well. So take care.